10 things only Sabi Sachi can tell you. So I'll give you a word. <laughs> Rani Mukherjee, best friend, loves rice, and I don't know, she's a true Bengali. You know, she lives in Bombay, but I think she's a Bengali at heart. One of the finest actresses that we've had, I think she's very sexy, and with her should only wear a sari and nothing else. She scares me. Deepika scares me because of the fact that I think she's so organized that, you know, I pride myself in being organized, but she's so meticulous and organized and so composed about everything that she does that I look like a rookie. Well, I didn't go for that, but I made the clothes. It was a lot of fun, and with Ranveer, there's no choice but to have fun. He just makes sure that you participate. I actually don't have an apartment in Bombay, but uh, I've been living at the Taj uh, Kolaba. Uh, for the last 15 years, I call that home. Well, 1999 was the year that I graduated and uh, it was literally like jumping off a cliff without a parachute and hoping that somebody would save you. Vipasha Basu. Mm, we used to call her Bonnie in Calcutta and uh, I made a blouse for her actually many, many years later. Uh, this was a blouse that was made for Bipasha when we were doing an audition for her for Ravan. You know, that, that part got deleted from the film and Mani Ratnam's Ravan. And we made this beautiful blouse and I said, this blouse can't be wasted. It was nice and it had a beautiful plunging neckline. And we called it the Bipasha blouse because it was made for her. And the Bipasha blouse became the most iconic blouse. And, uh, and every single bride in the last three years or four years must have wanted to wear the Bipasha blouse or have worn it. We have made about 25,000, 30,000 pieces of those blouses. So when Bipasha was getting married, she came into the store and she looked at the blouse and she had no clue that it was called the Bipasha blouse. She looks at the blouse and she says, oh my God, it's got my name written all over it. And I said, true that. You know, she's very misunderstood because people think that she's very beautiful, she's impersonal, but I think she's very, very warm. And I, I've seen Aishwarya transform from a beautiful actress to a wonderful mother, and Aradhya truly is the center of her universe. Mm, it was a scary experience because I was a very big fan of Mr. Bachchan, and uh, I remember uh, Sanjay just put me in the deep end of the ocean by saying that you're doing this film and you're going to be dressing up Mr. Bachchan and Rani Mukherjee and I was never introduced to him and then finally when I got introduced I remember going with two shaking hands trembling and showing him two shirts and saying sir which one would you like to wear and he looks at me and says isn't that your job to tell me which one I should wear and I call that professionalism when you respect somebody else for their vocation. I've done what I had to do in women's wear now the men's wear innings needs to start democracy. I still have to find them. What would Instagram be without trolls? Very boring. Frida Kahlo, forever. Diet Sabya? Well, I have not di Diet Sabya. And and the funny thing is that, you know, when, uh, when Diet Sabya uh, came out, so some people from my office said you should sue them because they're using your name. And I remember getting a text from Priya Tanna, the editor of Vogue. She said, you have truly arrived and somebody actually has a diet sub you're named after you. So well done, whoever you are. A 10 inch neckline, uh, the color red, and lots of layering and an overdose of jewelry. Perfumes, real estate, hospitality, shoes and handbags, beauty, make class watching, and Maybe do something like Airbnb. You never know. Keep wearing my clothes. It helps us grow our business. Hello, I'm Sabi Sachi, and we are celebrating 20 years of the brand. You're watching me on IDBA.